Hello, my name is Richard Northover, and I am the Managing Director of Navtor UK. The aim of this tutorial is to demonstrate the root functionality in NavStation. For today's example, I will explain both importing a root from an external source and creating a new root in NavStation. To begin, select the Root and Passage Planning icon, which will display your existing routes. To import the route from an Ectis or any other location, select the Import Root tab and search for the appropriate file location. NavStation is designed for both touchscreen and standard user interface configurations. To create a new route, firstly check the Saved Settings under the Configuration icon in the Vessel Particular tab and the default values under the Passage Planning tab are correct. Then select the Create New Route tab and name the route. For our example, I have titled it GrangeMath to Immingham. Then simply click to drop a waypoint on the chart and follow this procedure to add all of the waypoints for the desired route. As you will see, the waypoints contain the information set in both the vessel particulars and the passage planning tabs described earlier. You can click on a previously placed waypoint to adjust its positioning. The route can then be edited on a waypoint by waypoint basis to change from the default values as appropriate and to add additional detail, such as speed between waypoints, commencement and end of sea passage, type of passage between specific waypoints, pilotage, coastal or ocean, pilot embarkation and disembarkation, waypoint name, the names will be shown as a visual layer on top of the ENC. These can be added until we have ensured that everything is correct for the route. As you can see on our route, a wheel over line is displayed and related to a waypoint which is again based on the prior configuration. You can also reference your wheel over line to a position reference as shown. In this example, I have selected a landmark from the ENC and its position, distance and bearing will be recorded. Parallel indexes and also action points can be added for each waypoint. This concludes the tutorial for root functionality in NavStation. Please join the next chapter in which we will revisit our example route and develop it into a full passage plan. To find other videos in this series, please visit the NavTor YouTube channel.